stick your hands out of your pockets for my safety. I don't have any weapons on me. Sir, can you? Okay, can you can you check them? Because I don't know what. You cannot just pocket. check me. You can't Sir? do that. You can't go Sir? in my pockets. I don't consent to searches or seizures. Sir? Take your hand out of your pocket so I know I'm safe. Take your hands out your pockets. It's a safety concern for me. See how ridiculous it sounds? Okay, sir. Gotcha. You're here to protect and serve the public, correct? Yeah, I'm serving and protecting them from you. F from me? From you a camera? Well, this is private property, sir. This is not private property. This is private property. This is not private property. Is not private property. They don't want you on the property any longer, or you're causing a disturbance to the business and what they're doing, you're going to have to go. Sean, I don't know about your 10 followers or whatever you have on your line. Your tens and tens of followers. My tens and tens of followers. Hey, what's up guys? The Long Island Audit here, back again with another video. Today we're at the Motor Vehicle Commission here in Rahway, New Jersey. We're here today, as always, to peacefully exercise our First Amendment right to film in public and publicly accessible areas, to promote transparency and accountability within our government, and to ensure that our public servants recognize our rights and treat us with respect. Let's get into it. So over here is another Motor Vehicle Commission building. This is the road test building. You can see everybody here lining up for their road test. There's somebody coming this way. You can't record on this. You're recording. Yeah. You cannot record. There's what? a sign right here. Yeah, I saw the sign. Turn it off, please. Who are you? I'm the supervisor. Turn it off, please. Supervisor for what? For the motor vehicle? Turn it off. I'm going to get security and the police. You can get whoever you want, ma'am. Why are you getting so upset? Excuse me, ma'am. Why are you getting so upset? Wow. She was upset. As long as I've been doing what I'm doing, ladies and gentlemen, I'll never understand why they're so triggered over a camera. It makes zero sense. Absolutely no, no sense here. Who are you? I'm an officer. Officer and I what? Work here, Officer Gonzalez. Yeah. And you're not allowed to. Be Officer on the Gonzalez, phone. you know, I could use a little less of that attitude yeah, you got she's there. Telling you to you're, stop. you're acting you a little respect. bit extra. Yeah, I respect it, what she's telling you. Okay. Do you how does that? Here? Are you gonna take a test? How, how does respect equate into what I'm doing? Because she's telling you to turn the phone off. And I'm all right. So think about your logic here, Officer Gonzalez. I could tell you respectfully. Just go about your way and go back to doing no, your job. This is my job. This is private property. Your job is not to tell me what to do. Yeah, it's it is not. private property. That's no. Your job is not to tell me what to do. Your job is yeah. to do whatever it is else you're supposed to do. No. I, I'm not sure what it your goes, job entails. It goes with it. To, to, to tell me what to do? No. No, to, you have private property though. This is not private she's property. She's telling you not to turn the phone on. What, what you was recording? I'm recording everything that I can, anything that I can. Are you taking a test or somebody else is taking a well, test? Well, I don't have to answer those questions. You guys are both, you know, coming at me with real, it's real, you guys are being disrespectful, not me. No, you're being disrespectful. She's telling you. She's a but I don't have to listen you. to her. You and I and respectfully, I don't have to listen to you or her, ma'am. I don't. You want me to call Broadway police then? You can call whoever you'd like, because yeah. I don't have to listen to them either. No, the police That's are not going to come and get me. I don't have to listen to them either, ma'am. What are you recording then? I mean, honestly, what are you recording? You right now. Yeah, you have to respect what she's telling you. I don't. I, I, I don't have to respect, what, especially when she's telling me something that I don't have to do. What did she tell you? She told me to stop recording. What, 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 what is you doing here? But that's like me telling you anything. I, I would never, you, I would never dare. I would never dare. At this point, I don't want to answer any questions at this point. Because Are you of the way, the test? Because of the way you both have came up to me and treated me. I don't want to answer any questions at this time, ma'am. Are you taking a test? I told you I don't want to answer any questions, ma'am. I just told you I don't want to answer any questions. You can. I mean, ma'am, I'm not scared of the police. The police are here to protect and serve me, so that's their job description. She made good on her promise to call local law enforcement. So let's see if they educate her on our constitutional rights or not. Hopefully, that's the case. How you doing, hey, sir? What's going on? Hey, how are you? Good. Good. What's, what's happening? Oh, uh, nothing. Just taking some pictures and video, and uh, Officer Gonzalez 
and some other people seem to not like that a, a lot. So, well, this is private property, sir. This is not private property. This is private property. This is not private property. Yes, it is private property. It's not private property. I did it. I did. I looked up the surveys before I came here, and this is not private property. No, the state. This is owned by the state of New Jersey, which means that it's which is private property. You're saying that the state motor vehicle is part of this private property. No, it's owned by the state, which means that it's public property, sir. I, I think that's property. ridiculous that you would say that this is private property when it's this owned is by the private st property. It's who's it owned by? It's the, owned state. By the state. Yes. Okay. But so the, so you saying any any place in the state you could go there? Yeah. Go there? Any 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 state any part any any state property that's not restricted? Yeah, I can go but there. You're saying it's against their policy for yes, anybody yes. to get. <laughs> so ma'am, let me get this straight. This doesn't make any sense because Officer Gonzalez, you call him because I'm in supposed. Okay, the supervisor called him because I'm in supposed okay. violation of a policy. You're not policy enforcement, sir, right? You don't enforce assistant, policies. You're a law enforcement. Yes. I'm not breaking any laws. Well, this is private property. That's why. That's, this this is not private property. It's scary that you would think that this is private property, sir. Really. Can I get your name and badge number, please? Yes, right here, Withers. Yeah. Hello. Withers? Yes. Thank you. Hi, how are you, ma'am? Doing good. Can I get your name and badge number, please? Sure. I'm Officer Maloney. Can you take your hands out of your pockets for my safety? Oh, my hand in my pockets. Not again. Not for you, your safety. Yes, it is. It's for my safety, sir. Can it's you take a little chilly out here. I don't have any weapons on me. Sir, can you? Okay. Can you? Can you check them? Because I don't know. What you cannot just pocket. check me. You can't sir? do that. You can't go sir? in my pockets. I don't consent to searches or seizures. Sir? Hey. So take your hands out of your pockets. Please. You can't tell me to take my hands on my pocket. What? It's not against the law to keep my hand in my pocket. It's cold out here. It's a little windy I don't know out if here. You have a weapon. I don't. Show me I'm telling hands. you I don't. I'm not going to show you my hands, ma'am, because it doesn't that's not against okay, the law. I'll talk to you, over here you can't you can't just search people. What's wrong with you? Nah. Officer Maloney just trying to go in my pockets. <laughs> that's an illegal search. Rawway police. Insane. Can I speak to a supervisor, please? Yes, we gotta call one. Thank you, appreciate it. We gotta get out, sir. If you don't mind, just back up, let him get out. Thank you. So that's how the Rahway Police Department trains their officers to just go up to people. Right. Can I have a supervisor? Just go up to people, law-abiding citizens, and say, "Take your hands out of your pocket." And when I refuse to take my hands out of my pocket. So they guess, they automatically. Put it on YouTube, I guess. It can go wherever. Yeah, I know. No. That's what I figure you do. It goes you wherever. You those guys that try to record cops or whatever, put it on YouTube, I, Instagram, and everything. I didn't. I didn't nice. call you here. Nice. I didn't call you here. Nice. That's what you do to for And you shouldn't. Right? And you yep, shouldn't. Nice. And you shouldn't have any problem with a man exercising I didn't have his right. No problem with it. It's still me and a motor vehicle. Yeah, I mean, the motor vehicle. But sir, your so your what logic. Got to on that's I don't know. But all I know is that that. Is a problem. That officer's actions is a problem. You can't just go up into somebody's pockets. You can't she do that. Here, she tried to. You tried to. If I didn't, I backed away. It doesn't matter. You you have a weapon. So you have a weapon. You have a taser and a gun. What? You do. Okay. Right. Okay. You all have weapon. You all have weapons here. You all have weapons here. Except me, I'm the only one without a weapon. I'm the one with the camera, and you guys are terrified. I have a camera too, also. Sorry. Yeah, should I be terrified of you because you're recording? Ridiculous. Am I supposed to be terrified of you? Yeah, you are terrified of me because you tried to go in my pockets. I didn't try and go in your pockets. You tried to go in my pockets. Well, I don't know what you have in your pockets. Hey, Sergeant. How are you, Sarge? Hey, Sarge. If I can speak to you for a minute. Thank you. Well, that you got to do for my safety and. If Sir. you want to speak to me, take your hand out of your pocket so I know I'm safe in your state. But, sir, you have four officers, five officers I don't care, here. That doesn't matter. I've done this for a long time. They're asking you to take But you can see that I don't I have any see. weapon. I can't yes, see. Yes, you can. No, I can't. Yes, you can. No, does I that can't. look like... Does that so look? Just show me your hand, then. But, no, but it, it, it's, it's, an, it's a power I'm thing. I'm not going to entertain that It's a power it. thing. It's, it's a, power a power thing. thing. I'm asking to see your hands the way you can and, see And you can see what's in my pocket. No, I can't. I'm not asking to see what's in your pocket. I'm asking to see your hand. 
So if I took my hand on my pocket go. and so then now, I put my hand go. back in my well, pocket. If, if you want to put it back in your pocket, I'm that makes no the sense. Outside of your pocket to make sure there's nothing in there. So do you want to take your hand out of your pocket or would you like me to pat your I would like I don't so I don't I don't consent to any searches and seizures. I would just I'm like not to speak to you. Seizure. I'm not taking anything from you. I'm going to make sure I'm safe. They're safe. Everybody's safe. safe. What is wrong with you? Everybody there isn't is safe. What's wrong with me? You asked to talk to me. Yeah, and so I'm, now I'm here to And talk I'm here to, you. to complain. Excuse me, let me speak complain. please. I'm, I'm here gonna, I'm here to I'm issue a complaint. I see your hand out I'm, of your pocket. I'm here to issue a complaint for the that same until exact you take thing. I'm your hand out of your pocket. Let me speak to your no, supervisor. No, I am my supervisor. No, you're I'm not. the road supervisor. No, you're not. You, there's yes, you there's are. a lieutenant above you. No, he's on he's on the desk. He's not on the road. So if you want to go inside, we can go speak to him. You are you are giving off a horrible example for your police I'm department. Not giving a because I'm my hand is in my pocket. Hand there so I know everybody's safe. I don't know Everyone you, is don't safe. Know I don't know you, but yeah, you have a gun. He has a gun. He has a weapon. With it. Oh, my yeah. hand's not near my gun. So all I'm asking it doesn't you to matter. Take so I, can I don't talk have to you. a weapon. It doesn't matter. Well, so you, you should be able that. to call people. You should be able to talk to people I'm trying that to have the you. hand in the pocket. Well, no, I, that's not in one side. If you want me to pat it, and then I can be sure there's nothing. No, in I your don't pocket. consent. Okay. Well, but then I'm not going to speak to you till I know what's going on. So what's the deal? With, is he here for any testing? We don't know. Okay. Okay. Can I get your name and badge number, please? Sure, it's Sergeant Dayon. My name is D A Y O N 1138. Sergeant Dayon. I'm, my name is Sean. I'm an independent okay. journalist. I'm okay. working on a story here at the Motor Vehicle Commission. For what? Do you have their permit? Like, do you have their permission to be here? Did you? I, talk I don't need to their, their supervisor. I don't need their permission to be here. This is well, public property. It's, it's not public property in that sense. It is no, public it's property. It's public property if you're here to conduct business. No, it's if public. not, they can tell people they don't want to service them or they can't be on no, the property. No, they can't do that. Yes, they can. They can't do that. Yes, you're they wrong. Can. I've spoken to the, uh, okay. the Motor Vehicle well, Commission. Well, we're going to go speak to their supervisor they since they're, right away. they're on their way. We'll find out. If they don't want you on the property, you can go film from off their property. This is public property, It's not sir. public property. It is public property. Sense. It's public so everybody can come this here is and owned go to the DMV. Government it's, property yeah. is public property. Because it is. They don't want you. Government property is public property. If you're making them uncomfortable and they don't want you here. So you can kick me out your police there. station can i yeah can if you I have to or if there's a problem? if i'm recording recording what if you i'm recording inside and record. okay then so i can sit but here I'm and not, record this is that but that's my department it's that's not your department it's the people's department if they are saying they don't want you on the property it's that's going to be their decision to sign complaints that would against be, you and do that yeah that's fine i mean that's yeah. where we'll take it since you don't want to and you'll be violating my rights and then i'm going to hold you accountable that's, that's i promise fine. you that okay, well, you, i will hold the motor vehicle commission accountable hold whoever you want why are your officers so scared why do they not scared no but why why does your officers come up to me and say Get your hand out of your pocket. Because Get your hand out. And then try and go into my because, pocket. Because she attempted to go inside of my pocket. She, but did, she I had to back away from her. But nobody went in your pocket. I back away from you, sir, because that was... Sir, sir. You should I listen. You should really get another sir. job if you're going to be so scared. Like, we're not gonna, if you're going to be so scared, you, you should get. Scared. If you should get. If you're going to be so scared, you should get another job, man. Maybe work at a bank or something. Where's the? Where's, the, where's you guys? Where's the supervisor that runs this so we can decide whether they want him here or not? Yeah, whether you're going to get a lawsuit or not. That's 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 because you don't care because you're not going to pay it. It's not about that. If they're telling you, how long have you been? You how long have you been a law enforcement officer that you're scared? Long, I'm not scared of anything. You're scared you. of me. And my hands in my pocket. Film. I am scared. Because Why? People have things in their pockets. Sometimes oh my that god! Are ridiculous! Ridiculous! And then the most people that don't. They you say, sure, check my pocket ever, and we move on. In all the years you've ever been a law enforcement officer, have doing, you ever seen? Have you ever seen someone commit a crime and while they're filming? Yes. Oh my Absolutely. god, ridiculous. You're, you're lying. People have phones, they film everything. You're asking me a question. But you're lying. I have You've seen never people seen people film things, and what they're doing is a crime, and they get charged later or charged during it, and sometimes it's used for evidence. I don't know what the tell oh, you. Oh, yes, I've seen those too. They're, okay, they're called law enforcement officers' body cameras. That's question. what they're called. You're asking me. You're right. Law enforcement officers' body cameras is the one that films. Are they going to well, get she them? went to go get them. Sir, you have your ID on you? I didn't commit a crime, so I won't be handing that over today. Okay, what, what is your name, sir? I, I told the sergeant my first name's Sean. Well, can you tell me your last name? Because I gave you my last name. For my oh, no, no, no. I just don't give out any private information unless I've been suspected of committing a crime. I Nobody just, said you committed a crime. I know that. What said to you is if they I know that. that they don't want you on the property any longer or you're causing a disturbance to the business and what they're doing, you're going to have to go. That's what we said. We never said you were committing a crime. Is this your car, hon? All right, we'll move so you can get your car. Well, you asked for ID, so I just wanted to make sure if I was committing a crime because I don't hand over ID unless I'm committing Excuse a crime. Me, sir, you're going to get run over by 
by a car. I'm not scared like you, ma'am. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. When are we going to be on YouTube? I don't know. Yeah? I don't know. Couldn't tell you. Oh, okay. You got to edit it first, right? You not this part. Video? Not this part. No, you don't? You don't have to edit it? Oh, the parts of me walking around not doing anything, but okay. the parts of you guys acting this way, that's going to be what scared of, scared of, okay, yeah, let me go talk, uh, yeah, make sure you speak to the boss of, make sure you speak to the boss of the entire motor vehicle commission, so that way they don't make any errors. Group. You'll Cop figure haters? all that out. Cop haters, no. That's what's called? I train police departments. Oh, you do? Yeah. Oh, cool. Where at? Police departments come on to my, my channel. At? at their police department. Yeah? Yeah, I'll like, send you the yeah, video. Yeah, you got well, an email? I'll send you the video. Name, name someone? Oh, yeah, sure, I can, but I can send you the video of oh, me training police. I could I can send you the video of me of working. No, I, I work with what, the police. What, what department? I just don't work with tyrants and people who are scared. Tyrants? Yeah, and people who are scared of to and try and bully I people. I like to bully people. No, yeah, no, no. I mean, Mim, you I came up to me and told me to take us. my hand out of my pocket. That's you bullying I, me. I think you're bullying all of us. No. Yeah, you came yeah, up to so. me and told me to take my hand out of my pocket. Worry, just that part will be it takes a certain No. This whole interaction between you guys. Oh, the whole Ma'am, you got out of your car. And try to act super aggressive. I don't know if you're overcompensating because you're. Because I don't know what you're your doing. Actions. No, they're not. That's no one's scared. I didn't come here no to one's scared of my actions. You came here to no one is. Us. No one's scared of my actions. You're here to protect and serve the public, correct? Yeah, I'm serving and protecting them from you. Fr from me, from because a camera. They were afraid of you, ma'am. You're afraid of me. Cold. Are you afraid the of me, ma'am? You're well, afraid of me. That's what oh wow. Think, sir. I didn't come here yeah. on my own merit. Yeah. I came here because we were called here. You came the here. Is scared okay, that's of, fair enough. Of you. you. No one's scared of me. Oh, Ma'am, okay. you came here for a call, right? I'm here exercising a constitutionally protected okay, activity. That's, fine. that's your but, job to uphold not, that. But it's not That's your, your job, job to, to uphold that. I'm not harassing you. you. I'm, I'm I think your logic is flawed. You came up to me and said, get your hand out of your pocket. The video will speak for itself. The video will speak okay. for itself. You came okay. up to me and said, get your hand out of your pocket. I okay, didn't say, ma'am, take that gun off your holster, did I? Okay, sir. For my safety, take that gun off your holster immediately, right? I didn't okay, say that. Because that would be what? Escalating. Okay, sir. And we need to de-escalate okay, the situation, sir. not escalate it. Gotcha. Man with his hand in his pocket. I'm scared. Yes, ma'am, take your hand out your pockets, please. Take your hands out your pockets. It's a safety concern for me. See how ridiculous it sounds? Okay, sir. Gotcha. The sergeant is speaking with a supervisor of the Motor Vehicle Commission. Hopefully they don't make a big mistake here. Officer, what's so wrong with someone taking pictures and video in public? What's wrong about that? What's what's scary about it? Well, apparently, I guess you went inside the building and you record people? Oh, yeah, I've done it before. I've done it before in the in New Jersey Motor Vehicle Commission, okay. and law enforcement came out and they got educated, and everybody we learned that this is a constitutionally protected activity, and we went about our day, and okay. it wasn't a big deal. There's nothing wrong with taking pictures in public. It's called holding government trans government accountable, exercising a First Amendment Does right. Does name be a group? No, what no. Name be a group? I don't have a group. I'm by myself. I'm not part of a group. No, but you say you're a journalist. So I yeah, you what, I'm independent. You're gonna publish this under what? Independent. I mean, I'm for myself, correct, sir? Yeah. Okay. There's there's various sources where I publish. Okay. Various sources. I don't think it's a big deal to, you know, you should respect my rights, right? You guys took oaths, right? When you took, when you went into the, when you finished your academy, you put your hand like this, or you put it on the Bible, right? And you took an oath to uphold the United States Constitution from both enemies, foreign and domestic, right? You took an oath. I take that seriously. I didn't take one, but I take it very seriously. We the people deserve to exercise our rights peacefully. I wasn't being disrespectful to anyone here until someone came up to me and started, you know, screaming for me to take my hand out of my pocket and attempt to go in my pocket. But other than that, I, didn't I was, you, you did, it's on camera, it's okay. fine. That's why cameras are amazing. Bully, I'm not, you yes, are, you're a tyrant. You're not a bully, you're a tyrant, you officer. 
Do You're a tyrant. I'm a, I came here to expose you. You've been exposed, Officer Maloney. Okay. Okay. And my job is complete now. You've been exposed you got as a tyrant. I should pull all your body camera footages and, and post ahead. them all over and see see what we can find. You go ahead, sir. Because I have a real bad feeling that you're a tyrant. You've done this before. Okay, you violated people's rights before, I guarantee you. Okay. okay. I'll go to your apartment right after department right after this and record Please. and request all your body camera footage. You got it, sir. I'll review it for we the people. Okay, sir. You're supposed to treat the public with respect. Courtesy, respect. You're not supposed to treat the public the way you are. Alright guys, so the supervisor supervisor has come back. Can you do me a favor? I'm over here talking to my partner. You I understand. Can't interrupt my conversation. You I don't. I don't want to interrupt your conversation. Step away from me. You want to film over there? Film me, but don't get any closer to me. I'm speaking to my partner. It has nothing to do with you right now. Every everything that it you're talking about. To do with you everything right that now, you're Sean. talking about Step in public there, is do my not business. Get closer to me. Thank you. Everything that you're talking about is my business, don't sir. Get closer to me. Sir, this is public property, like I told you before. If you want to have a private conversation, I'm I suggest you go. I suggest you ha go in private and have that conversation, sir. Sean, I don't know about your 10 followers or whatever you have on your line, but don't get, you, you don't have any business in my conversation. You're a tyrant, sir. And I like I said, if you have a conversation no, you would like know. to have. Your tens and tens of followers. My tens good. and tens of so followers. Go in, get her information. I spoke to her. She doesn't have a, a separate complaint. Okay. So they're going to, the, the supervisor said if he wants to roam around and do his thing, he can do his thing. Okay. That he hasn't done anything beyond what their spectrum is. So we're done. So get her information. All right, we're done. Well, they do have a sign that says you can't record. But it's an unconstitutional sign. Very unprofessional, Sergeant. I'll be issuing a formal complaint against you and your officer. And Officer Maloney. I will be. And the people will hold you accountable. I promise you that. The tens and tens of followers and subscribers. You just gotta be less scared. Not ev not everybody wants to hurt you, officer. Way to represent Rahway Police Department. Way to represent. The people will see it, and they're gonna hold you accountable. Yeah. My tens. You're not gonna be that famous. I only have tens of. I only have tens of followers. According to the sergeant. Take care, sergeant. You'll be hearing from me soon. Okay. We're definitely filing a formal complaint against this sergeant and this officer here. They don't know the difference between public and private property. They don't know about our constitutional rights. It's sad, completely sad. We're gonna wait for them to do their walk of shame because they were definitely shameful here today and then we're gonna be getting out of here. I'm glad you got educated today, Sergeant. Hopefully they do something when I file that complaint against you so you can treat the public better. Another walk of shame here. You love to see it. I respect and appreciate good law enforcement officers who honor their oath to uphold the United States Constitution. These tyrants, ignorant tyrants here, bad attitudes, and we will be filing formal complaints against them. That's for sure. Without a doubt. They're getting out of here, so we're going to be getting out of here. All right, guys, so we're just getting out of the Motor Vehicle Commission here in Rahway, New Jersey. So from the start, we were dealing with some extremely ignorant public servants and security guards who did not understand our constitutional rights, tried to enforce an unconstitutional sign and policy. We have a right to record on public property and record the government in the course of their duty. 
public officials in the course of their duty. What is so hard for the government to understand about that? We the people are striving for transparency and accountability within our government. When we wouldn't bow down to the security guards' orders, unconstitutional orders, that's when they called Rahway Police Department and instead of de-escalating things and being knowledgeable about our rights, Rahway Police Department escalated the situation. Complete opposite of what their job is. They escalated the situation and they attempted to violate our constitutional rights. The all-female officer who arrived on the scene told me to take my hand out of my pocket. It is very windy here, it's very cold today, and I have my hand in my pocket. There's nothing illegal or wrong about that because she was scared. If you're scared with a man who has his hand in his pocket recording, then you need to look for a different line of work, that's for sure. Because you can't be scared of everybody who has their hands in their pocket. And I know where she learned that bad behavior from too because the sergeant did the same exact thing. Take your hand out of your pocket or I'm not going to talk to you. I don't want to talk to any law enforcement officer. They came here because of ignorant public servants who didn't know about our rights. But this is why I do what I do to educate and to expose tyrants like that female officer and the sergeant. The way they treated the public was unacceptable and I will be filing formal complaints against them for sure. Stay tuned for further updates on that. But everyone got an education here. The Rahway Police Department didn't even understand the difference between public and private property. They thought state property is private property. How ignorant. These are law enforcement officers that we entrust with authority to enforce the law and to protect our rights. And they don't know the simple difference between public and private. They don't know what the First Amendment is. They don't respect the public exercising their rights. The sergeant, you and your tens of followers. I could have told him that we have hundreds of thousands of followers across all platforms, but I'm not going to be petty like him. He'll see that. We the people are strong, and that's what they need to understand. That is exactly what they need to understand. They got educated today, and I hope they're held accountable. We will do the best to hold them accountable. We will file formal complaints. Stay tuned for that. As always, guys, let me know what you think about this one in the comment section below. Stay safe. God bless. I'll see you in the next video. Long Island Audit. Peace.